Increasingly, sports is thriving in Nigeria. We're beginning to see world-class sporting events being brought to our shores. Um, for instance, the Lagos Marathon is proving to be a win-win situation for all concerned. We're a country of 170 to 180 million people, whatever you believe. And with those numbers, we really should be thriving in the sports business. It's important to let people know the opportunities available in the sport business value chain, which is very vast. Actually, you can spin off up to a hundred different secondary income potentials you can gain from sports. Right now, we're scratching the surface. So this is just for people to know that it's an industry that is still decidedly under-marketed and under-exploited at the moment. In a global basis, the sports industry is under a transformation process that is demanding more and more professionals every day. Also here in Nigeria, there's a lot of potential for the sports industry and I believe education is key in order to, to bring the new talents that will be uh, managing this industry in the future. The sport business value chain is wide, it's vast, and attendees would know that they can also improve their processes. Technology and sport actually are like Siamese twins. You cannot drive any sport business without technology. Because the idea is, is about the numbers. You want to reach the maximum number of people in real time. And that's what technology gives you. They will be able to understand the industry from the point of view of the different stakeholders. And also not only in a global perspective that uh, brings the challenge that the industry is facing from all over the world, but also from a Nigerian and African perspective. Um, of course, there will be also some uh, networking and business opportunities, and we will have top uh, executives uh, from La Liga and from, as I mentioned before, different stakeholders from the, from the Nigerian sports industry. If you are related in any aspect of the sport business, if you are a sport business owner, if you are a sport media owner, anybody involved in the sport business value chain, this is for you because this shows you global best business practices. It tells you how to use technology to exploit hitherto unexploited areas of your business. And at the end of the day, it gives you a total worldview of what to do to compete with the best across the world. If you're involved in any area of the sport business, you need to be at this seminar. In my opinion, anyone interested in the sports industry, graduates or anyone that wants to build a career into the sports management industry, uh, should attend this program. It's going to be an exciting mix of sports people and also people from the intellectual faculties who will give you other rounded opinions about what to do with the sports industry. I'm excited to be part of this. And I feel anybody involved in the sport business should be excited about it because it's going to be two days of really, really very, very exciting, high octane uh, sports learning, so to speak. The program will be guided from the point of view of all the stakeholders of the industry and we'll have an overview of all of them. The format will be done through a mix of uh, classroom lectures, business cases and panel sessions mainly. There's hardly any Nigerian who doesn't have at least some interest in sports, be it football, be it basketball. Football is the major sport. So if you're interested in investment opportunities in the area of sports, this is the time to plug in. Because in five to 10 years, I think Nigeria will actually come into its own as a major, major hub for sports activity and sports investment in the African subcontinent. Through the changes we are seeing in a global scope in, uh, in the sports industry that comes mainly through digital, I believe there is a huge opportunity for African uh, sports industry to develop and to, to follow this path to, to improve in the coming years. And I truly believe that uh, this could be a way to, to increase uh, mainly the, the local uh, institutions regarding sports. <laughs>